This is Monique with your daily sunshine. Um, just really quick, want to bring you back, bring you up to speed, not bring you back to speed, bring you up to speed about what's going on. Um, maybe about a week, week and a half ago, we received a phone call after my dad did his monthly lab draw. And the doctor called and said, I don't like the way the numbers are looking. So won't you come back in, repeat the labs? And we repeated it last last Monday and the numbers were are starting to creep up so he only works at the hospital um, goes to the hospital once once a week and we couldn't see him last week so we just went back to John Hopkins to see if see my dad's doctor um, who follows him and try and see what's going on um, Right now, we don't have an answer, um, but we kind of been here before. It was a few years back. My dad's number was really going up, and they just could not figure out what was going on. And ultimately, it was his blood pressure medicine. His blood pressure was too controlled. So the way they kind of explained it to us was that, I guess, the... By the medicine, it was tightening up, and so when you go look for something, maybe um, it, it all deal with the blood pressure medicine. I can't really explain it or think about it, but it was just one of the issues. The way we came to this position now is that after surgery, my dad was, we've been dealing with something else post-surgery. Um, injury that he had from the hospital so him not feeling well us not you know on top of the labs things kind of have fallen through the cracks it's not too out of control but right now everything now being you know getting getting down towards okay the injury from the hospital is not as serious even though it's still being followed and trying to resolve that, the kidney is now coming into play. So just trying to stay on top of it and see what ultimately happens. Um, I'll take this, I'll, I'll in turn will um, bring this to you, making sure are you doing your monthly labs? Are you staying in communicate with your, your doctors or your home doctors if you had your surgery elsewhere? And are you staying on top of it? One of the things, um, one of the situations that we found out, the gentleman that was in my dad's um, dialysis, I guess I want to call it time slot, he lost his kidney. He wasn't taking his medicine and not staying on top of stuff. So my dad doesn't want to go there and go back on dialysis, but we definitely want to make sure we stay on top of stuff. And I, in turn, tell you, make you make sure you stay on top of stuff because my dad had surgery in February and now it's May. And just over that small period of time, things have started to develop, to develop and uh, it's now turning serious. And the thing is, we're a week away from anniversary. So I said, you know, this is a small hiccup. We're going to stay on top of this and we'll see what happens. And I will keep you posted. This is Monique with your Daily Sunshine.